Yo, what's good? This is Tahoe TV, and I'm about to vent. Um, all right, then, so, uh, you started, um, uh, you actually announced it first on the ADD podcast, uh, you was going to do, um, no, you didn't say you was going to do a sex podcast. I think it came later. You announced that you was going to be working with your original co-host at first. Mm-hmm. That's when you came up on the um, ADD podcast. Said, I'm about to be working with a boy. And then a couple months later, Heart of Soft came mm-hmm. about. What about, like, because you take it from a real educational standpoint. Mm-hmm. But I'm like, I don't know. I'm not, you know what I'm saying? I read, when I ran into you at Summer Jam, you was mm-hmm. like, <laughs> you came out. So do you eat ass? Yeah. Nigga, do you not see all these people? What the fuck? Oh, <laughs> they overdo it. Or want it to be done. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. But uh, um, what made you think, like, this was um, something that hasn't been spoken for as far as, like, black men? Tax told me to do it. Mm. Tax was yelling at me one day on the line. Stop apologizing, nigga. Mm. You stronger than that, nigga. You letting people you don't even know take you off your day. Mm. Stop, nigga. Like, yo, you want to make a mark in this world. You cannot be scared to make a mistake. You cannot be scared of people coming at you and and, and, and judging you. You can't. You got to make a mark. You got to go left, nigga. Jump off the biggest cliff and fly. You know what I'm saying? You got to believe in yourself. Mm-hmm. And so when I was thinking about what my next move was going to do, I just went all the way left, nigga. I was like, yo, nobody's doing this and nobody's going to do it. And like, nobody's confident enough to do it. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Um, niggas are living for how many women is going to respect them and love them. You know, a lot of men, that's all we do. But for me, it's like, I've always had that. I'm not scared if people judge me. I'm always going to be able to get this just part of me. <laughs> <laughs> and I shit, I remember when I was a kid, like I said, I remember I used to have a Jordan case. The little, I remember the, remember the sneakers, the white ones with the blue thing. And it came in the silver. Oh, the case. Concourse? Was it Concourse? Yeah. And I used to have a, a dildo. I walked around, I walked to walk Chick's crib in that case. Hmm. I used to go to Chick's crib with the dildo in the case, I opened it up with the rabbit dildo, and it should spin around with the pearls on it. Hmm. And um, so that was, I ate pussy the first time I had sex. Nobody, who ate pussy you the first time? You're a real I had nigga, sex? son. I'm talking you about nigga, this in the you know, banishment in high school. <laughs> oh, yeah, this, <laughs> this had to be in the age. Yeah, this mm, was like 88, 89. Mm, yeah. I ate pussy the 88, maybe. Mm. The first time I had sex, I ate pussy. Nobody was doing that. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Chicks wasn't even sucking dick like that back mm. then. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm a freak, nigga. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And, um, and I was like, fuck it. I don't care if people judges. You know, I seen what the ladies were doing, whole decisions and shit. I was like, yo, they killing it. Um, but nobody's speaking to the men. Mm. And... I just decided, like, yo, this nigga was a freak nigga, Orlando. Mm. That nigga was bogged out. <laughs> so I looked at him and I said, yo, I'm going to help you get to some place you want to be. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And I know I could do it. So we did it. And it mm. was great. Mm-hmm. I got you. Um, but I, it's, you know what I'm saying? Yo, y'all know what it is. This is Tahoe. I just vented, you know what I mean? I had to get some shit off my chest. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? We need to hear from you. All right?